In this question, we're given a composite shape, which is made up of half a sphere and a cone, and together they represent an ice cream cone. And what we have to do is figure out the total cost of painting the entire outside. So all of this part here and all of this part here. And the question tells us the cost is going to be $0.0035 per centimeter squared. So as soon as we see something centimeter squared, we know that we're talking about area. And the area in our case is going to be the surface area because we want the outside of the cone. Okay, let's break this shape up into its composite parts and find the surface area of each. We'll start with half the sphere, this part right here. And let's just kind of move that over to the side so we can get a visual picture of this. And we'll do the same for the cone part. We'll move that over to the side. I'm going to shrink that down just a little bit so we have more room to play. So the total surface area would be the surface area of half of the sphere plus the surface area of the cone. Now we know that the surface area of a sphere is given by the formula 4 pi r squared, where r is the radius. But because we're only dealing with half a sphere, we're going to divide that by 2. And we're going to add to that this lateral surface area of the cone. Here we only want the outside of the cone here. We don't want the, the circle part at the top because that's going to be covered by the half a sphere. So we only want the lateral surface area. And the formula for the lateral surface area of a cone is given by the formula pi r s, where s is the slant height, which is this part here, and r is the radius, this part here. So our equation here has a couple of variables, r and s. So let's see from our diagram if we can figure those uh, values out. So we notice right away that both the sphere, the half a sphere and the cone, share the same radius, which is from here to here. We're given the diameter of 12 centimeters, which represents the entire distance across. So the radius in our case here would equal half of the diameter, or 6 centimeters. And S, is the slant height, is given to us as 25 centimeters. So S equals 25 centimeters. So we can substitute these values here into our equation and find the surface area. So this would be, right away, 2 goes in there once, goes in there twice, so we get 2 pi times 6 squared plus pi times 6 times 25. So order of operations, 6 squared first, so that's 36, times 2 would be 72 pi, plus 6 times 25 is 150, so 150 pi. So if we add those together, we get 222 pi, and we know too that pi is approximately 3.14. So this would become 222 times 3.14, which equals 697.08. And the units would be centimeters squared. So this represents the surface area of our shape. And now we have to figure out the cost for painting that area. So the cost would equal the surface area times the rate. So this would be 697.08 centimeters squared times 0.0035 dollars per centimeter squared. And what we can see here is that the centimeter squared would cancel out and we're left with the dollars, which is what we want. And the units can really help us out because if we weren't sure about this equation here, 
All we have to do is look at the units and say, well, what would I have to do to this value and this value in order to get these centimeters squared to cancel out and leave me with the dollars? Well, the way we do that is to multiply the two. So let's go ahead and finish up. So if we multiply those two together, we end up with $2.44. We just rounded up to the nearest penny. So the total cost for painting the um, cone would be $2.44. And there you go.